Topper Eleven is high above North Texas, where much of the area is brimming with those first day of school jitters. A lot of students are eager to get back to the classroom this morning, but whether they have to wear masks or not all depends on what district they're in. We're going to get to those details in just a second, but first we need to set you up with what's happening between Dallas County and the state Supreme Court. So the court yesterday sided with Governor Greg Abbott and lifted a stay on his executive order banning mask mandates. That means the mask order in Dallas County has been shut down. It doesn't end here, though. Hearings in the lower courts are still going to go forward. Dallas County's hearing is scheduled for August 24th. Dallas County Judge Clay Jenkins responded to the temporary stay on Twitter saying, We are at war on behalf of moms and dads and kids against a deadly virus. I sure wish the governor would join our side in the battle. He went on to thank the superintendent of Dallas ISD. That's because despite the mask mandate being blocked in the county, students and staff in the district will still need to wear a mask as they return to school. Kennedy is live at Prestonwood Montessori in North Dallas to explain. Good morning, Kennedy. Hey, good morning, Karen. Yeah, Dallas superintendent is not backing down. He says that despite uh, the Supreme Court ruling in favor of Governor Abbott's ban on the mask mandate, that here, the, that the school district will not be doing the same thing unless the courts decide that for them. Now, he says this is because his attorneys believe the order only applied to Dallas County in general and not to DISD itself. This morning, Hinojosa will be here at Preston Wood Montessori greeting students as they walk in. He says the, ma the mask mandate is the district's best option to keep everyone safe. My decision is that we're going to continue with the mask mandate at this time. Why? Because the order that was issued by the Supreme Court applied to Dallas County, and it's listed Clay Jenkins and Dallas County. It did not say one word about Dallas ISD in that order. And so I have been on the phone with my attorneys all afternoon, and they are 100% unanimous. Now, Governor Abbott's ban will be readdressed in court next Tuesday. Karen? What about the other school districts in Dallas County? Yeah, there are several uh, school districts in Dallas County that will not be following the same um, mandate as Dr. Hinojosa. Um, those school districts are Irving, Garland, and Mesquite. They reversed course on their mask mandates after the order, moving from requiring them to just strongly recommending them. So definitely a very, very confusing few weeks for teachers, parents, and students. So it'll definitely be interesting to see what happens in the next few weeks. Reporting live in Dallas, Kennedy. Walker, CBS 11 News. Thank you so much, Kennedy.